this is Prashant and in this video tutorial we're going to learn how to screenshot or screen capture in Ubuntu. Now this is Ubuntu 12.04 uh, but the process remains largely unchanged. So it's very straightforward, uh, capturing is a breeze, you just go to the dash home, click up here, uh, you search for screenshot, obviously it appears for me because I've recently used it, helps if I can spell it and then the application appears. So I'm just showing you from scratch. You select the screenshot application and you get this dialog box. And much like the other operating systems, you have the opportunity to capture the entire desktop, grab a particular window or grab a particular area. Um, so let's just take you through one of these to show you the process. So I say select area, I then say take screenshot, select a particular area, once the crosshairs have appeared, I'm holding the left hand mouse button, I let go and then this lovely dialog box comes up and what it does is it gives me options. The option to change the name uh, and by the way the default is PNG in terms of file format, so portable network graphic and that allows me to choose which folder I want to save into. But it also allows me to copy to the clipboard at this stage and then paste it into another application. It's a very handy dialog box. In this case, I'll just save to desktop so we can see it appear. And there we go, it's just appeared on the desktop. My nice little screenshot selection. Now if I go back to the application, I'll show you a few other slightly more unique features. So something I quite like about Ubuntu is its native screenshot application allows you to delay um, your snapshots. So if I were to delay 10 seconds, I might want to do that and then arrange a whole bunch of windows so that my desktop looks just right before I take a screenshot. Um, so that's quite a nice feature. The other feature which I quite like is you can remove this little pointer from the screenshot and when you select window you can remove the border of the window which I think is fantastic and you can also apply an effect. So let's do the grab the current window and we'll delay it by five seconds to allow me to select the window and we're going to remove the border and we're going to include the pointer. No, actually, let's exclude the pointer. So I'll take a snap screenshot, and now I've got five seconds. So I quickly select on system settings this particular window, and there we go. Little uh, clicking sound and the flash, which tells me it's taken, and then the little dialog box. Again, name, folder location, or copy to clipboard. In this case, I'll copy to clipboard. Go to an application just the native office application in this case, right click and select paste and there you go. So as you can see the, the board has been removed from that particular window. So not difficult to do, very straightforward um, and look for them for most purposes it really does do the job. For those of you uh, a little bit like the Mac OS system who like to do things by terminal service commands the option is available. Uh, all we do is we go up to the dash home, select terminal, select the terminal application and we can do all the same commands using uh, command line. So an example would be let's do uh, capture a particular area and that would be gnome screenshot dash a and select enter and then as you can see my little cross has come up and then the same, the, the process we saw before pretty much uh, is in place. So I select a particular area and I get my little dialog box. I'm going to cancel that right now. So what I do, obviously there's a command for everything we've just seen uh, in the screenshot tool and I'll make those commands available to you hopefully below this video. So I hope that was of help. Uh, if you have any questions then please contact us. Thanks very much and bye.